Time now for an update from Fox Carolina News and Fox Carolina Weather. Weather rate certified most accurate. Good evening, everybody. Victoria Carmen here with your flash briefing update. Uh, we'll take you to foxcarolina.com right now to show you some of our top headlines. And it's a story that we've been following all afternoon, and we have some new information tonight uh, regarding a very sad story over in Spartanburg County. A teen driver is now charged with felony DUI resulting in death after a crash this afternoon into a sort of work garage uh, down a private driveway. Uh, you're seeing the mugshot of 17 year old Caleb Kennedy uh, on your screen right there. According to uh, troopers, uh, they tell us that this happened this afternoon just before one o'clock. It's about 1241 in the afternoon. Um, Caleb Kennedy was driving around Murph Road. Uh, he went down that private driveway, ran into a building on the property. It was kind of like a workshop because that's where uh, this gentleman, 54 year old Larry Paris, was working on some boats. Um, when he was hit just out of the blue, out of nowhere, uh, when Caleb Kennedy came barreling down that driveway. Uh, we're still learning a lot of information with this story, uh, but stay with us. We'll bring you the latest updates both on air and online. And talking about the forecast now, Chief Meteorologist Kendra Kent joining us with some chilly temperatures tonight into the morning. But gotta say, Kendra, it was a gorgeous day today. It was, and we're gonna continue to get warmer and warmer too throughout the next couple of days. Uh, oh, we'll start off the day tomorrow near freezing, 32 degrees across Greenville and Lawrence, 30 in Spartanburg and mid to upper 20s across Western North Carolina. So it'll be plenty cold in the morning, but the afternoon, oh, so nice for getting the kids outside. It'll be close to 60 in the upstate, low 50s in western North Carolina. It'll get into the low 60s as we get into late in the week, and then a cold front changes things this weekend. We'll talk much more about it coming up on the 10 and 11 o'clock newscast tonight. And don't forget to download our Fox Carolina app as well as check us out on Facebook and our YouTube channel.